can't figure out if I love or hate the cinematic background because I've had an absolute meh with my camera. I've lost the memory card, can't find the charger for it either. So I'm gonna have to film this part of the vlog on my phone until I buy a new SD card and find my charger for my camera. But hello, how are we all? I don't know if it's the morning or afternoon right now. I've got no concept of time today, but hope you're having a great day, whatever day or whatever time you're watching this. I just thought I would do not a weekly vlog, because I don't think it's going to be the whole week. I mean, I have got some exciting things coming up this week. I also don't know where to look. I've not filmed on my phone before, apart from like TikToks, but I can't actually see the camera. So if you're wondering where my eyes are actually looking, I'm probably looking at myself. Anyway, I thought I'd do like a check-in kind of vlog. I thought I would also show you what bits I picked up from Superdry this month because I am working with Superdry on a monthly basis as one of their student ambassadors. So I get to pick an amount of clothes every month and I show them off to you guys. This part of the video isn't sponsored at all because I work with them over on Instagram and TikTok if I want to work on TikTok too. But they aren't asking me to talk about this on my YouTube channel. But honestly, Superdry has such like amazing autumn winter pieces to like layer. I've turned the cinematic background off because it just it just wasn't doing it for me. But I also want to say that if you want to see how I style these pieces, you can head over to my Instagram. I will be posting some hopefully today actually. Not that you're going to see this video today, but I am going to be maybe shooting some content today. But the first thing I got was this coat. I wanted like a white, I mean I have a white coat, but it's not a waterproof one. It's more like a fluffy teddy type one. So I found this cropped. I don't know how to show this like to give it justice because it's so soft. I don't know if it's like feather inside. It's this cropped winter puffer and it's so cute. I'll show you it on in a second. Do you know what I also noticed? Cause us girls love pockets, don't we? And there's huge pockets on the outside, but then there's also a hidden pocket on the inside. It's just really flattering and I love this. I feel like it just adds to whatever outfit I wear it with and just makes it look more like put together and planned. It makes me feel cute, okay? That's all. Then I also picked up this lovely khaki coloured gym set and before you ask, no, I don't go to the gym. There is a gym in my building and I've been so sure that I'm gonna use it, but I haven't built up the confidence to actually go down and use the gym as of yet. There's still time. I've only been in this flat for like not even a month. So it's 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 still a settling in period really. I picked up the matching set. So this is the top. It has the option to take out the pattern, but I'm going to use the pattern to its full advantage. Size wise, I got the top in a size 10 and I got the matching leggings in a size 12. They look absolutely tiny, but I feel like that's always the case with gym leggings. Is they backwards? Yeah, they're backwards. But they fit. That's the main thing. And obviously the... I, Obviously they cinch you in at the waist, but I think I'm gonna wear this today with the coat if I go out and shoot content because it's a Sunday. I feel like green is the colour for this autumn and I did go with a green theme for my flat too, which you can't actually see at this moment in time because the only green thing you can see is the fej fe fejka. That is not the point of this video. Oh my god, I'm so nervous in front of the camera now. Next, when I tell you this is the softest, coziest hoodie I've ever felt, I am honestly not lying. I probably should have got the smaller size than this, but at the same time, an oversized hoodie, it just fixes 99% of all problems, doesn't it really? It's so thick, so heavy, so just... It just feels so like luxurious. I got this in a medium large, probably should have got the extra small to small, but it's definitely oversized. So if you want it to fit properly, do get your actual size. And I can imagine this with like a brown checked blazer on top. This could be worn as a dress with big long boots because it is absolutely huge on me and I wouldn't change it for the world. This is gonna be my go-to every single morning before uni. I wanna put it on now because it's just so cozy, but I'm gonna wait. Next, I picked up this little t-shirt. It's just got the super dry logo on with the ever since it what does does s e s t stand for established this fits perfectly it's also a really thick material as well so i can get away with not wearing a bra and that is the win in every situation and i bought a pair of pants to match this i mean this will go with literally everything in my wardrobe but i did buy a pair of corduroys to match this and it's just such a cute outfit with my dogs like but I got this in size, a size small, which I think is a 10. Then here are the cords in question. I do need to go and swap for a smaller size because I went into the store originally to try them on and couldn't remember if I got a 30 waist or a 32 waist to fit me. Or was it the leg? No, it must have been the waist because the waist is too big on these ones. But I sized up online when I ordered them and shouldn't have done that. The colour. Isn't this just me in a pair of pants? Like, I just love them so, so much. High-waisted, which we love. I do kind of want to get into the low-waist thing, but I'm just I'm just not ready. I have ordered a co-ord, not from Super Dry. It's from ASOS, I think it was from, which is low-waisted. I'm going to give it a go. It's not even for Lauren, it's for Laro. 
It's a very bad bitch. It's red. Let's go back to the pants. These are wide leg, really, really thick, really, really soft. Just perfect for autumn, really. I'm trying cinematic out again. It's just so weird filming on my phone because I've been used to holding like a heavier camera. But I also will do a flat tour in this video. I've been meaning to film a flat tour for ages. I'm trying not to give too much away, which is why I've gone back to cinematic mode for the moment in time. But I'm going to get ready. I'm going to go and buy a new SD card. Probably meet my mum and dad in town because they're Christmas shopping and I need to get a super dry outfit shot so I can post it on Instagram and do the ad. And then pop to super dry if I have time because it is a Sunday and it is getting on like three o'clock right now i think i think what time actually is it i don't know but also i have a question would people class this as like pajamas or a lounge where it said that you could wear out the house i can't even show the bottom of it because the um work tops there i bought this from bershka i showed it in my bershka haul and i'm just not sure because the model wore it on the website as like a thing to wear outside with like her air force but i can't imagine leaving my house wearing this so i do just use them as pajamas but i don't actually know my arm looks so hairy then. So I don't know. Also, you can get a sneak peek of my view if the camera focuses outside. I don't think it's going to, but do you want to see the view? I'm going to show you the view. So here's my view. I have massive windows, which I'm absolutely obsessed with. Down there, we've got the sexual health clinic. It's apparently also a walk-in centre, and that's a premier in. But I can see the live buildings. BBC Merseyside, and also radio city so i've been played on bbc merseyside so next stop is radio city wouldn't that be really cool but i can also see lime street is like down where's my i can't i'm trying to point but my finger won't show on the camera lime street is down there that little dome is clayton square st george's hall is there but i've got quite a nice view i've had some nice sunsets out as well which can't complain about but i'm gonna get dressed and show you the outfit on look at the, the obnoxious bag of quavers in the back that is such a bright yellow isn't it I've tried so many angles in this flat to try and show the whole gym set, but it's just not working. But this is the top half. I'm really enjoying it. Are we ready? Autumnal dream, if you ask me. It's also got a detachable hood, and I'm also speaking with my Bluetooth noise cancelling headphones on, so I can't actually really hear what my voice sounds like, and I hope the audio comes through, because that'd be awkward, wouldn't it, if it didn't? But, yeah, I'm going to go do my errands and stuff. I might get coffee as well, a decaf, of course, because us anxious girlies. Will I go to the gym wearing this outfit? Probably not. They didn't know it was vlogging, so they were really confused. Oh. Guys, I feel like today was off to a really good start. Um, I didn't have much of an appetite this morning, but I was like, it's fine. We'll get through the day. As you saw, I just went out um, to try and shoot some Instagram content. I got some pictures. I don't know if I like any because I wasn't really in the mood to be on camera. And I also wanted to do like a whole fresh face, no makeup picture and if i'm gonna be transparent i wasn't feeling myself <laughs> so um i'm gonna look through the pictures and see if i have any that i like usable because obviously it's an ad so it's got to be one that i'm happy with because it's got to stay on my feed and whatnot and i also bought myself a coffee has about three sips and dropped on the floor so that made me sad too <laughs> but i think in general i'm just having a bit of a anxious like a meta day like i'm obviously anxious every day but i feel like today i've come home took the gym set off and i just wanted to be in like comfy loose like oversized rather than like fitted because i'm just not feeling the best so that's what we're up to um but i think we're going out for a carvery later i don't know if i feel up to it but i also haven't had vegetables in like <laughs> quite a while so i'm gonna see how that goes there might not be any spaces because we haven't booked yet yeah i'm just gonna chill my mum and dad have gone to the car park while i came home to get changed because obviously like i live in town and yeah I just want to lie down and watch a film to be honest so one of them days hi besties update it's now about 9 p.m today <laughs> it's just bloody typical that i finally pick up the vlog camera and then today just hits me like a truck but i did end up going for a carvery with my family after lying on the couch absolutely freezing for like an hour two hours it just didn't feel well at all and now i've got a migraine so i am lying in the dark but the camera wasn't picking my face up so i was like right i'm just gonna have to stick the light on for a bit but i'm just in bed hopefully gonna get an early night i feel like my sleep has been a lot better so i'm counting every blessing to be honest and i'm happy that's going in the right direction so i'm just gonna watch some married at first sight because i'm quite behind um and yeah hope that my head's better for uni tomorrow i was gonna film a flat tour tonight when i got back as well but 
I just don't really have it in me right now, so I had other directions this vlog to go, but I feel like we've been realistic anyway, so that's the main thing. But yeah, I shall see you whenever I next pick up the camera. We get through the day and I'm just gonna hopefully get an early night and be nice and refreshed for 8.45 start at uni in the morning. <sighs> Give me strength. I feel like this filter is an accurate representation of me right now. I have decided that I'm gonna put the flat top in a separate video. I'm just waving these sprinkles around because I just feel like a flat tour at the end of that vlog would be really random because I feel like that was like a really like realistic day in the life of myself so to then throw a flat tour on the end of it just feels odd and I want to get this video up really quick and my internet in this flat isn't the best so I feel like if I add any more footage onto the end of this video I'll make it a longer video it'll just take even longer to upload so I'm just gonna put the flat top in the in the in the next one so stay tuned if you got this far thank you for watching so yeah oh love you all bye